Good day. I guess this is CC, and I'm Valder, right? Hey, Valder. How are you? Thank you so much for joining me here live in Dallas, Texas on the Valder BB Show. Hey, how are you? Hello, Dallas. A, thank you, thank you, thank you. And I, <laughs> Dallas welcomes you also, too. CC Carmichael, you are um, going to be talking with us about, you know, if you just don't have time to cook, you can give us some ideas. Yeah, I mean, I think we're everybody's slammed for time these days. It's a shame, and, and I, I'm not, I, I'm one of those people. I mean, I, I love Thanksgiving. It's one of my favorite holidays. It's about family and friends and especially the food. And I am traveling this year, and I don't have time to cook. So I am especially thankful for Boston Market this year because I, I consider them my, my resident holiday experts. If I'm not going to cook, they're the only other people I would trust. And apparently I'm not alone because they serve close to a million people a year holiday dinners and this is the reason why if you look in front of me here everything you see here is included you've got your appetizers your mashed potatoes rolls pie this gorgeous turkey stuffing and cranberry sauce and the beauty is it's under hundred and ten dollars and it serves twelve people i don't think i could do it for that price and another beautiful thing you don't have to clean up so i'm basically picking everything up and, uh, and the great thing also is that everything comes a la carte. So let's say Thanksgiving Day, Boston Market happens to be open, which is fabulous. You don't want to come empty-handed to your, to your uh, friend's house or your family's house. You can come and bring a pie or mashed potatoes. And everything's perfect as it is, but I, can't, I tend to like want to put my own little flair, which is perfectly acceptable. So, you know, I maybe get some roasted garlic and chives and little bacon bits for the the mashed potatoes, or to put my own little spin on it. You're perfect. They, they did a survey, and it says most people have no guilt whatsoever serving pre-prepared foods and calling it their own. So put it in a beautiful platter. I won't tell if you won't tell. And it's the easiest thing to do. If you can't do it yourself, do it all. Do some of it. It's perfect. If you go to bostonmarket.com, you can get um, locations, uh, recipes, and holiday hacks. Well, you sound like me and my uh, favorite chef, Sandra Lee, you know, semi homemade Yes. You can, <laughs> you, can do, you can make everything look like put it, if you put it anything in a beautiful container and, and just call it your own, nobody's going to be the, the wiser and they're just going to think you're fabulous. And nobody's going to call you on it. Either. Nobody's going to call you on it. It's no. about family. <laughs> it's about getting together. And it's like, this is gorgeous. Well, I couldn't make it look like this. Oh, I'm so glad I have kindred spirits because hol <laughs> the holidays are looming and I was sitting up here before I started my show. What I'm am I going like, to do? <laughs> yeah, <gasps> just take the stress out of it. I think, I think people tend to get like, oh, my God, it's got to be perfect. It's got to be all homemade. It doesn't. You can, you can customize it. Pick a, you know, make your own turkey. Get all their sides or, or get all their sides. You know, make all your sides. Get their turkey. It doesn't have to be really complicated. No, or you can make the turkey and get off the side. Like you said, you can mix it back. It, it just works. Yeah. Oh, you're, you're a goddess. <laughs> <laughs> well, I know other women are saying the same thing that I am because I know I work full time. I work in my own studio, but I work full time. Yeah. And you don't have the time. You're you traveling. don't. A lot of people don't. A lot of people don't cook, you know. And the other, I have a great my other my little secret weapon for. I, I actually I have it, Athens mini phyllo shells. This is uh, something I keep in my freezer for. I call it entertaining emergencies because they're this little bite-sized shell with endless possibilities. You can use them for appetizers. You can use it for dessert. You just pull them out of the freezer, thaw them. I've got a couple recipes right here. I call them recipes. They're so easy. I'm, in, I'm almost embarrassed, but they look like a million bucks. Get the phyllo shells, get your favorite crab salad, chicken salad, fill them up, put a little garnish. Garnish goes a long way for making it look beautiful and custom. And these are the dessert. I, I do every, a lot of desserts with these because they're perfect. People can pick them up. Um, this is a caramel chocolate macchiato mini phyllo tart. All it has is four ingredients. It's got cream cheese, macchiato creamer, a little chocolate, and the Athens mini phyllo shells. And that's all it is. You stick them in the refrigerator, let them sort of uh, firm up a little bit. They are so delicious. You will look like a rock star chef in minutes. Always have these in your freezer. I'm telling you, they will save your, your life more times than you can count. That's so perfect. Where would you send them? Because I'm in love with Boston Market. <laughs> I'm a Boston Market fan. Where would you send my audience to get more information so they can look as good as you and I on Thanksgiving? 
Go to videopomp.tv. All the recipes are there. The, uh, we've got all these recipes and where all the Boston markets are and uh, little holiday hacks. And uh, so just everybody take a deep breath and just enjoy the, the spirit of the holiday, which is about giving thanks and spending time with your family. I'm looking at one Facebook post and someone said, you saved the day. Thank you, <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Thank Thank you, you. Valder. Have a happy holiday, Dallas.